Hey, what's going on? It's Big Grime. Here to kind of make an update on the V vocal, kind of explain some things. You got a lot of dumb motherfuckers hitting me up. Um, you got some hitting my inbox. I even had people hit me on my email. They leave comments. Some of them are positive or some may, you know, critique or say, you know, auto tunes is better and all that. All I was saying was, and I want to clear the air, I never said that V vocal was better than auto tunes. All I said was, if you have sonar and you want to get the T-Pain effect, you can do it in the V vocal. Now, you can either go out there and spend $200. I think they have now uh, auto tunes for like 100 that at least it doesn't have as many features, but you can do the T pain effect with it. But you can go out there and spend a hundred dollars when you don't have to. I don't really use it, but if I had a song that required to, you know, for me to do a little bit of T pain effect or something, <clears throat> then I have it on V vocal. It makes no sense for me to go out and spend a hundred dollars on the shit when I already got it. So the point blank is, I never said that V vocal was better. The reason why, like some people say, oh, because uh, auto tunes you can use in real time. Well, the reason why they don't have it in real time is so that it reserves some um, CPU usage. <clears throat> like the CPU usage on this thing is crazy. Like I can have fifty thousand of these things of uh, V vocal up, and it's not really gonna touch my CPU. So that's you know that's the reason for only have it as an offline or um not in real time plug in. Um a lot of cats be like, well how do you get it? How do you get it? Can you send it to me? It only works in sonar. It comes in sonar. It's not even it doesn't even come as a separate plug in that you can give the people. It's integrated into sonar. Okay, so let's say All right, so if I was to record myself talking into this, and then once I finish, you know, singing or whatever, <clears throat> I right click on the on the on the uh, on the clip on the vocal clip. Even if I just didn't want to do the T Pain or the whole thing, I could just slice it by hitting S and just whatever clip I select is what the T Pain effect is going to be on. I right click. I look for V vocal. If you right click, if you got sonar and you right click and you do not see V vocal, you do not have the right version of sonar. I do have questions when people say, well, does it work on sonar five? Or it's sonar five, six, seven, and eight. They, they came out with V vocal on sonar five. So if you have four, no, it doesn't work. Three, no, it doesn't work. Two or one, it doesn't. It's not, it's not, they don't have it. They didn't come out with it until version five. So right click on the vocal track or clip that you want to put the T Pain effect on and look for V vocal and create V vocal clip. Or to make it simple, you just highlight what you want to use and hit Shift V. Wow. That easy, right? Then it shows my pictures and what I was talking in or whatever you're singing in. And really all the T-Pain effect is, is basically flattening the notes digitally. And that's in general how you get the T-Pain effect. So even, and the thing is about V-Vocal, even when I do that, sometimes I may have to go in and make some adjustments after it's done, or, you know, I might have to make some adjustments. But you can get a decent T Pain effect out of this plugin. And me singing on it and in my last video, it was just a quick demonstration, just in general how you can get it. But like I said, you can make basic adjustments to make it sound better and get the sound that you really want. And this is for people who don't really give a damn or give a shit about doing the T Pain effect that much. It's just that sometimes you may want to do it and you have the plugin to do it. Why, you know, spend the money? for something that you're not going to really use that much when you have it integrated with uh, your DAW system that you already have. Then that was the whole point of the V-Vocal video. 
All right. Um. Yeah, like I said, people ask you, can I give it to them? I can't give it to you. You know, go buy a sonar. Spend some money. It's not. It's not that that hard. It's not that expensive. I mean, this is one of the cheaper things you're gonna spend. Okay, you spend five hundred dollars to be able to create music. Spend five hundred. You're better make beats, record, do everything that you possibly could want to do with music can be done with five hundred dollars. If you said that, you couldn't say that eight, nine years ago. Couldn't say that. You know, yeah, you might need to get an interface, you might get a little mic or something like that. But in general, you can do everything in a sonar. So don't ask me, can I get it for free? Can you get it? Where can you get it? You can go to AmericanMusical.com. Matter of fact, let me show y'all. All right. American. Go to AmericanMusical.com, which now is at Sonar 8. What I have is Sonar 7. I just haven't updated yet. When you get there, go to search, type in Cakewalk. And I don't know if some of y'all don't know about this, but it's ridiculous if you don't. All right, you go and you scroll down. Okay, walk well, music software. Better yet, just type in Cakewalk Sonar. All right, Cakewalk Sonar Producer. Click on that. Now, it's four ninety nine. Now you can get the studio version, which I believe does have the um, V vocal in it. But think about it: you can put down ninety nine dollars and ninety and sixty seven cent, which you probably end up being like a five dollar transaction fee or some crazy like that. But okay, one hundred four dollars, one hundred four dollars, no credit check. $104, you put down, they ship you the product, you'll get it between three and five days, um, depending on where it's shipping from, because they ship from New Jersey, and they ship from Phoenix, I believe, or somewhere in Arizona. So I live in Virginia. New Jersey would be closest to me. If the product had to ship from New Jersey, I'll get it, like, in two days or next day. Where if it comes from Arizona, it may take, like, three days, four, four days. But all I got to do is put down $100, dog. A hundred dollars, and you can get the studio version. Or if you want the producer version to get all the extras, it's a hundred and sixty-six dollars. And then you pay that hundred and sixty-six dollars for three months. You put it down. You know how you put shit on layaway. You don't get the product right away. With this, you get the product right away, and then finish making the payments. If you cannot spend a hundred and sixty-six dollars, you don't need to be doing this music shit. Like you don't need to be recording. If you got any, if you got a microphone. You might as well go ahead and just break it up, break up all your equipment, and don't and just forget about music if you can't spend that kind of money. It's ridiculous. But that's my take on the V vocal. I may do another video demonstrating like the different editing features like more in detail. But for right now, that's my take, my response to a lot of you dumb motherfuckers. Fuck you very much. Check me out, myspace.com slash biggrime one. You don't have to spell out one, just type in number one. Peace.